Hey guys, Dungeon J here. I'm coming back with episode number two of Rage. I'm just diving in deeper. We're going to go ahead and continue the quest line from where we left off. Uh, like I said, I'm kind of interested to see what all uh, Rage is about with now Rage 2 being confirmed and actually seeing the gameplay trailer, which looked really interesting. I hope you guys have checked it out by now. If you haven't, uh, I think what I'll do is I'll put a link down below to their main gameplay trailer so you get an idea of it. It looks like it's uh, very much fast paced. Uh, the gun uh, play looks amazing. It definitely has uh, a more of a, uh, uh, a feel to it with RPG progression and I'm actually really excited for that title. Uh, also um, I just I kind of like how the two companies are merged together to make this happen but anyway bottom line ID software they do know what they are doing and they can come out there and just knock shit out of the park I feel like Rage 2 is going to be it I know there's some drawbacks to the original Rage reading the reviews and stuff like that and I know I'm going to probably hit a ceiling where I, I might not enjoy the game as much I hear that it's kind of linear even though it's supposed to be open world but we're just going to go ahead and kind of check it out and see now I need to make a little trip down the way to the next settlement. And that's what we're going to do. Alright. Good deal. Check it out, guys. Got a lot of work to do here, pal. If you need something, come by later. Maybe I can help. Alright. Looking for Rick. He's up there. Alright, so it looks like we're going to go talk to Richter. The man in charge, as everybody's saying. You need something, stranger? Of course. Mm -hmm. Well, Dan's running into some trouble again, I see. Well, Janice is going to need to see this list. Go on. She's just up there. You're the note, but when you're done, come back here. I may have something that'll interest you. Alright, sure. Sounds pretty cool, so I'm going to get a recipe. Uh, you know the way it works here. We help you, you help us, right? A member of our group, Juno, went missing a few days back. Last I heard, he was headed up to the radio tower to the southwest. Please look for him. And I'm going to get a recipe if I do this. So that sounds really good. I will make a side note here, guys. I really like that metal arm on her appendage right there for her left arm. It's really cool. And she looks like she's like a nurse or something like that. And then also the spectacles, man. You gotta dig it, dude. You really do. I think it uh, adds a nice little touch to it. But uh, all right, so we're gonna go ahead and accept that. And I pray that he's safe. Well, we'll find out, man. We'll find out. All right, real quick. Let's see. Now I picked up armor. And, okay, I guess I've got it on now. Okay, so it just automatically puts on the armor for you. You don't have to uh, worry about it. It was an armor upgrade for your arc suit, arc armor. Okay. Not exactly sure how that affects me. Oh yeah. Help us out here. I'll give you a real weapon. That sounds good to me, man. Let's see. Our radio tower up on the hill stopped working. We need someone to fix it. Yeah, probably 
you're just out of the line of it. You get it fixed for me. I'll give you a shotgun. Sound good? So he's gonna give me a combat shotgun if I go fix this tower. Good luck. This should be an easy job. Alright. Not really digging the way you keep blocking me, man. Alright, so we're gonna head back out here. And, uh, let me look at something real quick. Let me look at the uh, quest log. Where's that quest log at? Right here. Alright, where's Juno? And to the northeast to the radio tower. So they're both in the same location. So while we're there, we need to go ahead and repair that. I'm going to drive my vehicle. Alright. Well, can't drive it really far. And it's a pretty linear path there, guys. Looks like that's the only way I can really go. Nice. I like that. Let's see if there's anything in here. Alright. Got a little bit of a, uh, a spooky vibe to it right here with the music and everything. For a flag, yeah. All right, so I don't know. He looks like a bad guy to me. Nice. Lit me up pretty good, though. That's right. So, it looks like I can go this way or I can go that way. Let's see what's out this way. Oh, yeah. Oh, look at that. That was right on his head, man. Oh, shit. Really? I can't hit the son of a bitch, man. Not sure where I'm going. Not sure what I'm doing. So that's where they take a shit at. Good to know. The Lou. I should have read the sign. God. I hurt like hell, man. So this will take me to the section where I was shooting a boy. 
He must have. All right, he must have bled out. Good deal. Okay. All right, so the radio tower is up this way. And this is a dead end, it looks like. Locals only. Can you climb this? Look at that, guys. Look at that. Just kind of checking it out right now. Get ready to die. All right, the wasted garage. All right, so I don't need to go there. I need to go ahead and go with the radio tower. Which was up this way. I don't see anybody. That got me. That got me. Alright, All right, so there's Juno's remains. Activate the recaliber. So I need to go this way? me to take the zip line down. Interesting. Okay. You made it back. Go talk to Richter. He's waiting for All right. So let's go talk to Richter. Not right now. No, not a bad stranger. Didn't know about the mutants. We usually don't get them this far out. You did good though. See Janice. Just wait to hear what you find. Oh, look at that puppy. All right. 
So I have exactly 34 buckshots. Juno's dead? Yes. I knew something was wrong, but I had hoped he would show up. This world takes so many good people. But thank you for looking. And oh. here is what you need, as well as the plans to make your own healing bag. Oh, you're so nice. Just look for the things listed and put them together. They will help you whenever you are hurt. Thank you again, and good luck. You received your first engineering recipe to use it go to the engineering screen in your inventory. Okay. So you need uh, two bandages and an empty, uh, antiseptic formula. Aside from its uh, disinfecting power, it also has the main ingredient of a martini. Alright. Well, I've already got it, so I'm going to go ahead and build it. And exit. Good deal. Now I've got the medical supplies. Now it seemed like some advice before you go. These hills are crawling with bandit tribes. They mostly fight each other, but if they find you in their turf, they'll kill you first, then figure out if you're friendly or not. You watch yourself. Alright, do you have anything else to say? Better get those supplies back to Dan. Wouldn't have sent you here if it wasn't important. Okay. Alright, now this other guy said, uh, do I want some work? People need to be warned about those mutants. Take this firework cluster to the ridge north of here and shoot it off. I've got a launcher there, and it won't be hard to find, but hurry, we're moving soon. This place is getting too dangerous. Let's see those fireworks. I'll give you what I paid you now. Excellent. Now, take this firework cluster and shoot it off on the bridge. I've got a launcher there. It isn't hard to find. Alright, so... That's an interesting proposal. I think first things first, though, is... I should go ahead and um, Be safe. return the medical supplies first. Now let's see. Probably need to set the quest. So let's set this one as my active quest. That's what I'm talking about. Alright, let's go give him the medical supplies. I'm starting to think I made a good decision by saving you. You truly are someone we can trust, and I am in your debt. Okay. Now go talk with DR about that buggy. Look for him in the garage. I get a buggy. So where's the garage at? Should be able to help. Sound good? Okay. Okay. See you back here when you get the parts. Can I take his ATV again? Nice.
So, oh, do you need, need some parts, parts for that old buggy? Yep. Man, he should just junk it. Now, I'd like to give the parts to you, but I'm afraid I have a small problem. Afraid bandits raided my garage not too long ago and ran off with most of my spare parts. You're gonna need to go down to their hideout near the old dead and find what you need. Think you can handle this? Could get a bit hot in there. All right, so this is the things that he's looking for. I need to get a piston assembly, an alternator, a distributor cap, uh, and he's also giving me uh, a lock grinder schematic so that I can break the lock. It won't be easy taking on the bandits on their own turf. Here, take some fat boys for your pistol. That ammo kicks some real butt. In case you run into any locked doors, take these plans to build a lock grinder. They do exactly as their name says. Good luck. Okay. You receive 12 Fat Boys, a new ammo type for your pistol. Fat Boys are much stronger than regular pistol rounds. You can select ammo type when you equip your weapon. Alright. But, I'm going to go with the combat shotgun. Right now. This whole area is beginning more and more dangerous. Bandits and mutants moving in closer. Stay sharp on those ruins out there. Deal. All right, so let's pull up the map again. Getting a lot of quests. They're just very linear right now, guys. Hopefully, uh, that's not how it's going to be through this whole gameplay, but we'll see. All right, so I want to go ahead and do the mutant alert one. I want to drive to the North Ridge. I want to set that one as my active. I went ahead and I already put it off once. Let me see, uh, let me see something real quick. So they both want me to go in the same direction. I'm gonna set that one first. I'm gonna do that one. Damn it, I didn't wanna do that. It's all good. Alright man, we are blowing past it right here. Okay, so... Here we go guys. Just checking out my surroundings a little bit. What the f Any more of those bastards? Let's see, uh, let's pull up the next quest. Alright, so I did that. Let's set that as active. go 
All right, so at this point, I could go back up that ridge right there, which I just went to. Or I could turn in that quest real quick and see what it gives me. I think I'm going to go ahead and do this quest right here. me to go back through here okay except this time we're going no we're going the same way okay no bandits this time Okay. Where you at, dude? Right in the face. Let's go ahead and loot these corpses again. Very gross, guys. Very gross. So this is going back to the section that I didn't go through before. Uh, you guys remember. out of buckshot though here we go entering the garage uh, I need to go ahead and save to use EMP grenades to fry the circuitry of enemy sentry bots all right so I need to find the alternator I'm gonna go ahead and save the game right there I'll select that we'll override it yes sounds good to me zoom all right, guys, so we've gone a little bit further into the gameplay. Uh, now I'm exploring this section. Uh, just giving you guys more of my thoughts of the game as it's progressed. Um, dude, I got kind of, uh, uh, I didn't expect the two mutants, so I thought that was actually uh, kind of cool. It kind of gave me a little bit of a, like a shock scare with that setting and the music and stuff like that. But so far, I feel like there's a lot of repetition in the quest lines. I got to see if maybe they're going to blanket it out and ever let me have some free reign to kind of explore and stuff like that. That's really what I want to get into. Uh, if it doesn't, if it's just a linear path, then that is what it is. And uh, hopefully uh, that might be why we've seen some of the, uh, uh, why there was so much stigma around rage itself. Uh, but we'll continue to dive into this and uh, I may do a couple more game plays or I may finish this game up uh, solo. I don't know guys. We're just gonna go ahead and see how it progresses. So this is gonna be episode two. And uh, we'll see if we'll dive into episode three. If you guys want me to continue to do this and uh, go through this gameplay, perhaps you guys haven't played Rage, uh, you're interested in it, um, let me know down below. But uh, that's going to be it for this video. This is Dundee J. I'm going to go ahead and sign out. Guys, have a great day gaming. Later. <laughs>